Destiny 2 is about to reach new heights with the release of Bungie's new expansion, Shadow Keep, releasing September 17th of this year. Coming with the expansion are a mass plethora of changes, new features, and additions to the game. One of those said features is cross save. In today's video, I will be explaining why cross save in Destiny 2 Shadow Keep is a win for gamers. My name is Buckeye, and welcome to the video. Thank you everyone for tuning in today. I hope you go on to enjoy the video. If you do, I encourage you to hit subscribe and check the video's description for some important links. Now into the topic. Cross save is a massive new feature that is coming to Destiny 2 in the fall. Long have Destiny players been begging Bungie to add a cross play or at the very least cross save to the game. Finally, a request has been accepted. This is going to allow the community to no longer be segmented by platform and instead allow everyone to play with everyone on whatever platform they decide to play on that day. That is huge. In a way, it is kind of cross-play, since your main account will transfer to all platforms. Instead of playing on Xbox with someone on PC, you can simply jump over to that platform and play with that person with your same account. That is absolutely fantastic. I will be utilizing this myself as I have many friends who play Destiny on Xbox while I personally play on PC. Now we'll be able to play on Xbox together or PC together without having to grind out double the content on both platforms just to play with each other. Now, why is this a win for the broader gaming community? Well, we have to ask first the question of why did it take so long to bring this to the game in the first place, right? It has been a highly requested feature for quite some time, so why now? I don't have an actual information on this, but we can infer that the limiting factor involved here is the hand of Activision and stubbornness of Sony. It is no secret that Sony has been very protective of their platform throughout this entire console generation. Back when Fortnite was trying to get cross-play among all their platforms, Sony was the platform holding that back for quite some time. Now we see, as of yesterday, that the announcement of Sony being involved in cross-save for Destiny was in fact a very last-minute decision on their end. According to a report by Jason Schreier, Sony did not commit to cross-save until Bungie met with them one last time the day before their announcement. Bungie was able to convince Sony to be a part of the program. However, the fact still stands that Sony was not on board at the beginning. Now, while this is apparent that Sony was still sandbagging this entire endeavor, it is important to note that progress is being made, and this is why cross-save in Destiny 2 is a big deal for gamers in general. With the new Modern Warfare game going to be cross-platform and now Destiny 2 being cross-save, a new precedent is being set for platform holders and game developers that gamers want to be able to play their games anywhere with anyone. Big congratulations to Bungie on being able to achieve such a monumental task, and I am personally excited to partake in this feature myself coming September 17th. Anyways guys, that is it for me today. Real quick, I want to thank everyone who watched my last video. That is now my most successful gaming video in well over a year. I greatly appreciate all the support on that video. It really does mean a lot. Now with that said, if you enjoyed today's video, I encourage you to leave a like and subscribe to see even more content just like this. Also, check out my Twitch stream. The link is in the description. I'm live every Monday through Friday at 10.30 a.m. Eastern playing Destiny 2, Halo, The Witcher 3, Horizon Zero Dawn, and even more. But anyways, guys, that is it for me today. I will see you in the next one.